Hello everyone and welcome to my video. I'm Dr. Madi. Today and in this video we will learn how to convert PowerPoint to PDF and video. At the end of this video, if you like it, please push the like, press the subscribe button and also share it with your friends. Now let's start the video. For example, I have this PowerPoint and I would like to have it in PDF shape. I mean, I mean in PDF format. First, I need to go to File and Export. Here, create PDF slash XPS document and create. Uh, I need to push uh, create PDF slash XPS. And uh, first, we need to select the location. I mean, the place that we want to have our PDF. For example, I would like to have it on my desktop. I select desktop. And here we need to select the name for uh, our PDF, for example, my uh, presentation, something like this. And here we have two options, uh, a standard and a minimum size. Here we can select the quality level. When we select a standard, definitely quality will be high, but uh, it will take too much space and it's better to select minimum size. Definitely when we select minimum size, quality should be worse compared to a standard but anyway it will take uh, it doesn't take too much space and then we need to click on options in options uh, if we would if we want to include all of the slides i mean for example we have a powerpoint with 10 slides and we would, we would like to have all of the slides we need to select all but sometimes for example we would like to have only one slide in a uh, in, in the format of PDF, uh, we are in uh, slide number five, and we would like to have only this slide, I mean current slide, in the format of PDF, we need to select current slide, current slide, uh, and sometimes we would like to have uh, some slides in the format of PDF. For example, I have a PowerPoint with uh, 10 slides, and I would like to have a slide number two, five, and seven. Uh, in the format of uh, PDF, I need to go to my PowerPoint and I need to push the control key and select the slide number 2, 5 and 7 and then here we need to uh, select selection and after that we, uh, we will have only these three slides in the format of uh, PDF. Sometimes we would like to have uh, some slides in the format of uh, PDF for example from slide number 1 to number 5 here we need to select number one and to number five or no for example from number three to number seven we can here select and here in slides when we select a slide uh, uh, definitely for uh, in every page we will have one slide i mean if we have a uh, 10 uh, for example if in our powerpoint we have 10 slides and now we convert it to pdf definitely we will have 10 pages I mean, in every page, one slide. But sometimes, no, we would like to have two, three, four slides in one page. Here, we need to select second option. In this case, we can select two, three, four, five, six slides in one page. For example, I would like to have uh, two slides in every page. Definitely, if I have 10 slides, my PDF will have five pages. And at the end, OK, we need to uh, click on OK and publish. Now I will have my uh, presentation or my PowerPoint in the format of PDF. Here you can find it, my presentation. Something like this in uh, every page, uh, two slides and something like this. There is also another method that uh, you can convert uh, PowerPoint to PDF. It's not uh, very different uh, from the first method. It's a little bit different. Again, you need to go to File and Save As. Here, you need to select the location. I mean, the place that you want to have your uh, PDF. For example, the stop. Here, you can select the name. My uh, presentation 2, for example. And then... Uh, here I select PDF and more options. In more options, we have options. From here, it will be similar to the first method. Again, here you can select the quality level. And also here, options, you can go and change if you would like to have for all of the slides in the format of PDF or no one slide, some slides. Here you can select and also how many slides in every page. And then OK. And at the end, save. 
sometimes we would like to save, I mean, we would like to have our PowerPoint, our, present, our presentation in the format of a video. It's not very difficult. Again, you need to go to File and Export, uh, Create Video. I mean, the second option, Create Video. Again, here you can select the quality. Uh, full, uh, when you select Ultra HD, uh, quality will be high, and then and after Ultra HD, Full HD, HD, and a standard. If you have too many slides in your PowerPoint, you can select Full HD or HD, because when you select Ultra HD, uh, it will take too much space. Definitely, quality for Ultra HD will be better than Full HD or HD. But when uh, you have too many slides and you select Ultra HD, in this case, it will get uh, too much space. Then when, but if you have no, for example, two, three slides, it's better to select Ultra HD. Otherwise, try to select Full HD or HD. For example, here I select Full HD and create video. Again, here I need to select the location, desktop, name, uh, presentation, three, something like this, uh, and save. And here uh, you can see progress in saving. I mean, uh, PowerPoint uh, is saving in the format of video. So now let's go to the desktop and see the PowerPoint in the format of video. Yeah, now you can see my PowerPoint in the format of a video. I uh, hope you found this video useful. At the end, if you have any comment or question, you can write it below in comment section. If you liked it, please push the like, press the subscribe button. You can also hit the bell. Uh, in this case, you will get notification whenever I publish a new video. And at the end, please don't forget that life is short and enjoy it. Thank you so much and bye.